Greetings, everyone. I want to talk about a scripture in the Bible that can very easily be overlooked. The scripture says that the very hairs of our head are numbered. Why would God even bother to know the number of hairs on our head? Now, with me, it doesn't take much for God. You know, I, I save him a lot of time. <laughs> but the point is, God cares about everything about you. He's omnipresent. He's everywhere at one time. He can handle everything that needs to be handled. You would think that, I mean, if, if you look at God like a man, you would think that he has more important things to do, like the crisis over in Iran and uh, people dying and going to hell every day, which is the, uh, is a big issue. But God doesn't, uh, he's not like man. He can do everything at once. He's omnipresent. And when you go and fellowship with him and get into his presence, you're the only child there. Because God can handle every individual and every individual's issue and deal with them as if they're the only person there. Because he's not a man. He's Almighty God. And the most important thing we need to know about God is that he's our father. He's our daddy and we can come to him at any time with any issue. And he cares about the small things in life. Now it's easy for us to think about, okay, I, I get it, Pastor. He he knows about the big stuff and he'll deal with the big stuff, but he leaves the small stuff to you. No, God cares about everything. The very hairs of your head are numbered. Think about that. I'll, I'll give you some examples of uh, in, in my life uh, about how God cares about even the small things. I was um, on my first missionary trip overseas and I was in Sweden and it was uh, a two country trip I went to Estonia and Sweden I don't remember which one I went to first but anyway when I was in Sweden uh, I was with my host family eating dinner and I noticed in the kitchen on the window ledge they had these marshmallow peeps now I love marshmallow peeps they come out at Easter and other holidays, Christmas, and and certain times in the year they come out. Anyway, not a lot of people like them. I, I, I guess a lot of people like them, but I don't know a lot of people who like them, but I love peeps. And I they caught my eye, and I said, wow. Um, and I asked them, I said, uh, those peeps over there, you like those peeps? They they said, well, somebody gave them to us. Nobody likes them, and we just set them up there. Now, I am convinced with all my heart that God had those peeps there, and it was way after Easter. But those peeps were kept there just for me. They had those peeps there. They didn't throw them away or give them away. God had those for me. Things like that that happen in your life, Thank God for them. N notice and pay attention to those things. It's like God is winking at you saying, I love you. He's smiling on you. See, you are the apple of God's eye. An another illustration before I let you go that happened recently. My wife loves Hawaii. We've been there before. She wants to go back. She always talks about it. Recently, a few weeks ago, my our personal assistant emailed Carla and said do you know you got 60,000 miles on Delta and do you know she can fly to Hawaii for ten dollars and I think I'm gonna go with it <laughs> I hope this helps you today What's what's the bottom line? Okay, I want to make sure you get this. God cares about the um, small things in your life as well as the big things. 
He cares about you. He cares about the things that you care about. Why? Because he loves you. Make it a great day.